There's a wide variety of circumstances we can encounter. Uh, uh, enforcing laws, whether they're on a, a municipal level or the criminal code, they tend to be quite fluid. So what can start out initially as a, a curfew in a park can, can escalate into something more serious. Uh, so we are trained in handcuffing and using uh, police batons and different hand-to-hand uh, -hand combat techniques. <laughs> I've been attacked on several occasions. Uh, sometimes the person was high on drugs or drunk. A few other times I caught people trying to steal a car, got into a physical intervention. They did not want to be, they noticed I was alone and I was working alone. And it was techniques we learned in classes like this that helped me subdue and control the person until backup could arrive. If you have to use it once in 30 years, it's more than worth it for the training. I personally, in 14 years, have had at least 20 physical interventions. So maybe one, one and a half a year. But trust me, when that physical intervention happens, you are very glad to have that training. Montreal Police Department is very big, and uh, the officers circulate from station to station, and they're not stationary in, in, in any one post for very long. Uh, but here you get to develop a relationship with the people in the community. And uh, I think that goes a long way in, 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 uh, in, uh, in uh, keeping the peace and uh, keeping the community standards as they are.